Hey everybody and welcome back to Terraria. When we last left off, it was a blood moon after we made our world into hard mode. So things are interesting to say the least. Look at all this. Possessed armors. You know it's been a while since I've seen you guys. Yeah, you're just as annoying as I remember. Oh, I knocked him down for six. Do they have new noises? I don't remember them making those noises before. Look at all these guys down here. Let's just do this. This will be fun. Uh, so what's my plan for today? Well, I have a few plans. I have a few different things that I want to do. Um, one of those things is... Oh, I dropped down by accident. One of those things is to... Obviously collect the new ores and stuff, so we can get some good equipment, good armor, better than molten armor. Um, better pickaxes, better weaponry, better all sorts, honestly. Oh, clowns! Forgot about those. I might get some banana rings here, you know. That'd be nice. Uh, a nice starter weapon for us, banana rings. What I'm also hoping to be able to do is collect some... Uh, go to the dungeon and collect, if we're lucky, the wizard. Because if we can get the wizard, I can buy a crystal ball, and with a crystal ball I can make that infinite quiver that I want. This seems just like a little bit too cheaty, sh shooting from up here. Also, I love the Cobalt Shield and the fact that I no longer have knockback. It's so good. Oh yeah, I can bring up this little boy as well. So I apologize that you can't really see what's going on down here. Let's drop down and see what we got. A fast... Oh, it's a bride. I've seen, it. I've seen you before. Uh, fast clock, I think we don't have that yet. Which is good. Because that means... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's new for us. Which means we can... Get one step closer to the Ankh Shield. In fact, what do we need for the Ankh Shield? It's all stuff that I can get now, isn't it? Now that we're in hard mode. I might start looking into that. I need to fight werewolves for a bandage. Which means a full moon. Other than a full moon being time sensitive. Is there anything else I need? I don't know. I don't know. Go away! Just try it, just try it. Get out of it! Get out of it! Feed my 150th zombie in this world. Um, I'm a little bit weak, let's drink a potion. Anyway, you may have noticed when I checked my inventory a second ago, I brought some stuff with me. I brought some crates that we fished up before. Since we're in hard mode now, we can get hard mode stuff, such as hard mode ores, but also, specifically, hard mode exclusive drops, um, like pets and stuff, I don't know. So we can open those. Uh, if we don't get anything interesting, I can dump them in a chest. I am going to die in a second. But, you know, we don't have a house in a hard mode blood moon on our first evening. But we, we do get Blood Moons on almost all of our... Uh... Hey, why am I not using my Hive Pack? I don't need to protect myself from fall damage. I'm going to get some good bees out. Some beautiful good bees. Oh, you see that? You see that shot? Freaking amazing. I'm the best at this game. I really am. No one, no one on the face of this earth is better at Terraria than I am. Of a potion. Give me this stuff. We've got a shackle. Oh no. Oh no. Fell in a right little hole of death there. Eat all of these magical attacks. I oh, died <laughs> to a regular old eyeball, dude. That's fine. I'm just kind of waiting for this night to end. So I can uh, 
have a peaceful day. So there are, there are a few things I want to do, like I say. And you know what? I'm, I'm actually a little bit sick right now of waiting for these guys to disappear. So I'm just going to do this. And that should take care of him. And then let us ugh, get rid of this crap. Let's open these crates and see if we get anything good. So I can open them straight from the inventory, I believe. Um, let's do the wooden ones. There we go. Boop. We got all this stuff. We got mine potions, apprentice bait, platinum bars, mithril ore is pretty nice. Let's see healing potions go in the bin. Swiftness potion, journeyman bait, 13 gold ore. Uh, gills potions and some lesser amount of potions which can also go in the bin. So overall, not that great, but two iron crates gets us, ooh, healing potions, I like it, sailfish boots, I haven't seen those before, hunter potions, whatever, and I love it, enchanted sundial, the enchanted sundial, you guys, I've wanted that for so long, I can actually skip the blood moon now. Um, and two golden crates, which got me um, greater mana potions, gravitation potions, 20 titanium bars is really good, and some of the seven of the best bit. That is actually really freaking good. Right, first things first, put that down. I need to, I need to use it. How do I get in there to use it? I did it! Go away, Blood Moon enemies! <laughs> Get out of here. Be gone. Oh, that's so good. Goodbye. Wait, Riff, you, did you turn around? Did you actually turn around, Riff? Did you actually turn around to fight me? Get out. Get out. I love the fact that I got an enchanted sundial. I love it. That's so perfect. Right, first of all, quick stack. Uh, next of all, this chest. Um, let's dump away everything we can possibly dump away. Except for the titanium bars. Because if I get some wood, can I now make a titanium pickaxe? Which is like the best pickaxe for a long time. No, I'll need to make a titanium anvil. I don't know how to do that. How do I make a titanium anvil? I'm sure I have to make a titanium anvil, don't I, before I am allowed to... Uh, where is guide? Another dryad. He has to be in the furthest possible place, isn't he? I'm sure that, um, you need to, or is it a titanium, no, you need a titanium forge and a, a mithril anvil, or an orichalcum anvil. Is that right? I don't remember, but either way, we've got 20 titanium bars, which I think is enough for a pickaxe. Making the pickaxe is probably the best thing for us to do, rather than making any weaponry because we can use it to you know, mine up stuff a lot, lot quicker. Uh, also, is the, it's not in this direction, is it? No. We need to go to... Oh, yeah, this is where I need to go. I'm being an idiot. Bye, turtle. Uh, we need to go to the corruption area, smash up the altars with the pawn hammer that we brought. I think I need something from you guys, don't I, for the ankh shield? Do I? Oh, we've got the mummy mask. Cool. Nice to know that the enchanted sword is still, you know, fairly decent as a weapon. I need to go up here, so let's just go straight north. And by north, I mean skyward. Huzzah! I'm here! Talk to me. Kyle! What can I do with titanium? Yeah, I want a titanium pickaxe, which needs 20 bars, which we have. And that's it. 
On a Mithra anvil, it says. Okay. It's really hard to read because it has all this text on the screen. We can make the frost armor if we have the frost cores, which we don't. But hey, that's cool. Right, so let's go down and let's prepare to get absolutely wrecked by a bunch of wraiths. Because every time I smash one of these altars, uh, three wraiths, I believe it is, will spawn. And I think the best bet is for us to just smash as many as physically possible. Because, you know, means more stuff. Palladium. Oricalcum. Adamantite. Here come the wraiths. Smash all of these. I know I know I left one. There's too many wraiths over there. Right, what is this one? So each one each time we smash it we get progressively less and less stuff from them. You know, to be added to the world, but whatever. Smash it! Right, I would love to do one more. Is there one more hanging around? I think that's one. Maybe that's one. Where was that? It's just on here, wasn't it? Yeah, that's one. No, smash this one. Look at all those riffs! That's a lot of riffs! Alright, let's um... Let's do this. This should do pretty much a load of damage. If it ever touches them. I'm out of mana. I'm out of mana. I was out of mana. But you know what? We, we killed as many as it took to kill them. What? <laughs> we <laughs> smashed up as many altars as we possibly could. We, our world is filled with stuff. We're going to go down. We're going to grab up lots of ores. Uh, I think... I don't even know what the best way down is to go searching for ores at the moment. But now, I feel like I'm rushing hard mode. Because my goal is simply to get down... Go away, digger. My goal is simply get down there, find the ore, like, like here's a palladium look. Get this ore ASAP, and then get straight into... having titanium stuff. Give me that palladium. Extra shiny. Yeah, it is. Because I really, honestly, the, the biggest downside for me right now is the fact that we are slow at mining. Is such a... slowdown for us. It, it annoys me. Drop down, please. Thank you. So if we can fix that by getting as... No, first of all, we'll have to make a Palladium pick. Second of all, we'll have to make uh, a... Yeah, get the Palladium pick. Using the Palladium pick, we mine up the Mithril. We make a Mithril... Anvil, but not Mithril pick. And then we go straight to Titanium Anvil, thanks to 20 Titanium bars we got out of the Golden Chest. The golden Crate. So holding on to those crates was actually really, really... Uh... I don't want to say clever, but it was like, I'm so glad we did that. Because it has absolutely helped us out. Uh, that's Mithril, which I don't believe we can get right now. Oh, here's some Palladium. Oops. Oops. Please mind this stuff. There we go. How much do we need? I think it's five per bar. And I'm assuming we need like 20 bars. So 100 all? Is 100 all going to be enough for us to make a pickaxe? Maybe. I, I guess we'll grab 100 all. I should probably assign these two. There we go. Let's grab 100 all if we can. Let's not hang around to fight things that we don't need to fight. Yeah, let's see if we can grab 100 ore, and then go to the surface, make a pickaxe, and then... If we can get ourselves into titanium level... 
in like our first episode of hard mode. That would be amazing. Right, I'm not going this way. <laughs> There's a, it doesn't be too, too much stuff down there. Also, one of the things I really want to do, and you guys... Is that palladium right here? That can't be right. No, it's copper. I was going to say, that's just, that'd just be silly. Uh, that is also copper. I started to say something and I instantly forgot. I f it's a ghoul! What is that thing over there? A Lamia! Ooh, interesting. I have a feeling that Lamia is probably going to be pretty freaking tough, so I'm not going to fight it. Oops, it is. Drop. Lamias and ghouls. I wonder if they have any cool drops. I will fight this stuff. <laughs> what have I done? I've gone straight back up to where I was. I imagine these enemies are going to have some cool stuff, and I will check it out. Just not right now. Because I'm probably going to die if I do. Oh, boy. Get stuck. Get stuck, you idiots. Oh, crap. Oh, whatever. You got me down here. Right, this is the kind of level we want to be at, I guess. Looking for... Um... Palladium. Got some hallowed stuff. Oops. Is that some palladium? I think that's a tiny bit of palladium. Go away, Tomb Crawler. Oh, that's what I was saying. Yeah, there, there is some stuff that I want to get from hard mode to put in our build. Obviously, our main build isn't... Um... You can go. <gasps> That was ridiculously close. Um, obviously, our main world isn't in hard mode, so we can't do that yet. But we can grab it from here. And I'm not going to show me trying to grab it for forever and a day because it will take ages to get enough for what I want. But basically, what I want to get is... Uh, you guys have seen by now, definitely, the Marble Tower build. Uh, you may have noticed the... Hello. The storage room. There is something I didn't do in the storage room. Because I didn't have the hard mode thing that I wanted. And that hard mode thing that I wanted is crystals. So I'm going to have to mine up at some point. A... I want that palladium. I'm going to have to mine up at some point a ton of crystals. I don't even know how many, but it's going to need a lot. And I'll do that off camera, but I'm going to try and wait till I find some in-game, I guess. Does it matter? I don't think it matters. You guys know what crystals are. They're not exactly new. I want to mine them up anyway, make some stuff out of them, um, and then I can update my... Let's kill a lamia and see what that is. Oh, waste slime. Okay, we killed Lamia. Didn't drop anything for us. Doesn't mean it can't drop anything for us. Just that it didn't. What is that? A basilisk? This place is filled with new and scary enemies that I don't really want to fight. There's another basilisk. Okay, I will, um... I'll fight you guys later, I promise. Later, I just, I just need a tiny, tiny, teensy, tiny, shweeny, shwiny bit more palladium. No, Basilisk! How did you find me? Um, I, I really want to grip that. Uh, that'll do. Take this. I'll use all my magic and then I'll use all my bees. And then another Basilisk will come and kill me. <laughs> I just need nine. I might not even need nine more. Let's see if I can make it with what I've got. It's going to save us a ton of effort if I can already make it. So I think we need a health forge, which we have, so that's not an issue. Pillion bears. Oh, it needs three. We've got enough. 
Easy. Boom. Anvil. Make me a palladium pickaxe. Boom. Done. Stick that up there instead of that one. So we go from... Uh, what is this? 100% pickaxe power to 130%. So instantly it's a nice speed upgrade. But more importantly, it allows us to mine stuff. Uh, most of this crap can just go away. So I'm going to quickly do that. And then bang in. We've got some sapphires. And then this stuff can just get thrown away. And that going there. Right. That's going to do it for today's video. We've made our... Get out of it. We've made our Palladium Pickaxe. Here it is. Look at this thing. What's even got on it as a modifier? Dangerous. Damage, good strike, size. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. Here's our new pickaxe. When we retain, what we are going to do is we're going to get some mithril, make a mithril anvil, and then make a titanium pickaxe, and just be happy. Then we can mine up whatever we want, make titanium armor, do whatever, blah, blah, blah. Maybe get on with some other cool hard mud stuff. For now, though, thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.